The movie is on the topic of religion. The Kerala Story is an Indian Hindi language film directed by Sudipto Sen and produced by Vipul Amritlal Shah. The plot follows the story of a group of women from Kerala who are converted to Islam and join the extremist Islamic state of Iraq and Syria. The Tamil Nadu government has stated that the Article 25 Freedom of Religion of the Indian Constitution guarantees every citizen the right to propagate his religion, while replying to a petition in the Supreme Court. The petitioner complained about the instances of forceful conversion in Tamil Nadu, violating the fundamental rights. The petitioner sought an National Investigation Agency CBI Central Bureau of Investigation investigation into the root cause of the death of a 17-year-old girl in Tamil Nadu amidst a swirl of accusations that she had been forced to convert to Christianity. The petition argued that forcible or deceitful conversion was a violation of fundamental rights. Tamil Nadu government has replied that the acts of missionaries to spread Christianity by themselves cannot be seen as illegal, since the constitution guarantees every citizen the right to propagate his religion under Article 25. However, if their act of spreading their religion is against public order, morality and health and against other provisions of Part 3 of the constitution, it has to be viewed seriously. Every citizen is entitled with this right and liberty to preach, practice and propagate the religion of his choice. An opportunity is also provided by this right to spread it among everyone without any fear of government intervention. But also, it is expected by the state to practice it amicably within the jurisdiction of the country. India is home to people following different religions and having different faiths. As per the Few Research Center 2021 data, there are 4,641,403 people who follow other religions apart from the six major religions which are Hinduism, Jainism, Islam, Buddhism, Sikhism, and Christianity. So with such a diverse population, following different religions and beliefs, it becomes necessary to protect and secure rights regarding the faith of each and every religion. Secularism. The 42nd Constitutional Amendment in 1976 added the word, secular, to the preamble of the Constitution. India being a secular state, is a no-state religion which means that it follows no particular religion. In Ahmedabad St. Xavier's College vs. State of Gujarat 1975, the Supreme Court held that secularism neither means anti-God nor pro-God. It just ensures that no one is differentiated on the basis of religion eliminating the concept of God in matters of the state. Constitutional provisions related to freedom of religion. Article 25, it imparts freedom of conscience and free profession, practice and propagation of religion. Article 26, it gives freedom to manage religious affairs. Article 27, it sets freedom as to payment of taxes for promotion of any particular religion. Article 28, it gives freedom as to attendance at religious instruction or religious worship in certain educational institutions. Secularism in India vs. US. India follows the concept of neutrality and positive role towards religion. The state can introduce religious reforms, protect minorities and formulate policies on religious matters. The U.S. follows the principle of non-interference in the matters of religion. The state cannot take any action in religious matters. For more update please like share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.